Over the years, I've installed probably hundreds of the Harmony 650 remote to help people get rid of the clutter of remotes that they have on their coffee table. And this Harmony 650, although not perfect, is a wonderful device. Now this video is to teach you how to use this with Blue Sky TV. We had a technician come in and install Blue Sky TV and he told us that the remote was radio frequency, also known as RF, whereas the Harmony remote is IR, also known as infrared. And the Shaw technician told us that we cannot get the Shaw TV or the Blue Sky TV to work with the Harmony remote. And this is wrong. There is a, a easy hack to get this one working with your Blue Sky TV and I'm here to show you how it's done. Okay, so I've launched the Logitech My Harmony app, which is necessary for programming the Harmony 650 or any of the Harmony devices. And the activity we're going to be dealing with is Watch TV. Now, if we view the settings, you'll see that I've I've added in an old Motorola STV device, which was formerly in there. We're going to change it over to an Aris AX013ANM. So here we go. We go to Devices, we add a new device, and here we type in Aris, and then it's going to be AX013ANM, just like that. Yes, and just ignore this message. Okay, so now we've added the Aris DVR. Actually, I already had it in here, so we'll just delete that. We don't need both, but uh, so I guess I had previously done this. But here's the Aris DVR, which we've added in, and here's the one that we're going to stop using. So let's delete this device now, and then we're going to start using this one. So we go back to Activities. You'll notice that there's a warning symbol here on the Watch TV Activity because we've deleted the device that we were using. And so it's just telling us that. If we click on the Watch TV, we're going to go and change the settings. And we'll just click through all these settings. Uh, and we have to remember to add in the Aris DVR as one of the devices that we're going to be using, along with the sound system and the TV itself. And which device do we change channels? All these settings will remain the same. I've already set them up from before. There's my sound system. There's the HDMI input that I'm using. There's the line in that I'm using on my sound system. And now we're done. And then after that, we simply click the sync. I don't have it hooked up right now because it's already synced, but that's all you need to do. And we will now be able to operate Blue Sky TV with a Harmony 650 remote. Okay, now we're going to test the Harmony remote and we're going to start the Watch TV activity. Okay, so here's our channel guide and uh, I can turn that on and off with the guide button on my remote. I can go back to the guide. Well, let's exit. And then our page up, page down functions work fine. And there we have it. Blue Sky is working with the Harmony 650 remote. 